and Maddie. Alec and I will be talking about some of our friends who have two dads. Hi Maddie, two dads? Wait, don't they have a mother? How can they have two dads and no mother? Well, since there are so many children without any parents living in the foster care system, and two men who are in a better relationship want to be parents, all states must now allow them to adopt children, and that is how children can have two dads. So these lovely individuals would adopt a child who otherwise wouldn't have a home? Well, that is great. All children deserve to be with a loving parents. It should not matter if they are two dads or two moms. I am sure there are many mom and dad parents that are unfit to be parents. So if two dads have the desire and ability to be good loving parents, then why not? Well, until last year, not all states agreed with this idea. In fact, the state of Mississippi fought against same sex couples adopting children for many years. Yet, a judge forced them to change their laws last year. That's and crazy. So, up to last year, if two men that were married or in a long term relationship wanted to adopt a child that might otherwise want to have parents, some states fought against this? Yes, it is true. Many states and many people have so much hate and ignorance in their hearts and minds that would rather see a child in an orphanage than be with two loving parents. I know we have a student at our local school that has two dads and they are so loving and kind and that girl is so happy. Exactly. Mommy and Daddy have other friends that are gay or lesbian that have adopted children and are such great parents. I like today's subject. I can't imagine people who would want kids to be in an orphanage home or foster care rather than being adopted by loving people. Thank you for joining us. I agree. Thank you for joining us. And join us next time when we discuss DACA, the great accents for childhood arrivals. Ciao, everyone. Bye, everyone. <laughs>